Okay, we're going to be making a download cable for the Uniboard. We start with a 3 meter stereo headphone lead. We have a plastic DB9 shell and the actual DB9 female connector there. Uh, the 3 meter headphone lead will cut in half, we only need half of that. And we'll take off some of the insulation off each connector, off each wire, should I say. Inside there, there should be a white wire and a red wire uh, surrounded by a shield. What we're going to do with that shield uh, is we're going to uh, spin it away. So that's the shield there, uh, which is twisting it away from that red wire. And we'll do the same to the other side, there should be a white wire there. There we go. And we'll cut away one of the shields. Doesn't matter which one, we'll go with, uh, with that one there. So we end up with three wires red wire, white wire, and a shield. Now, when we were taking the insulation off the wires, we've got a couple of little bits left over. We can uh, use one of those and just trim it down to size. We can actually cover that uh, exposed wire there. Uh, it's a good idea to do when you're putting it into a DB9 connector so that it doesn't connect to other things inside the uh, inside the plug. So we'll just spin it on there. It's a little bit fiddly to do. Um, I find that if you spin it around a little bit as you're applying it, uh, it'll get in there okay. And now we're just going to take the insulation off each of the uh, red and white uh, wires and spin them around a little bit. Uh, we'll also pre-tin them with the soldering iron, just so that they're nice and ready to solder. There we go. After we do this, we'll trim them down just a little bit, just to expose a tiny bit of the, uh, the pre-tinned cable. Not too much, just a little bit. There's my cat in the background. Okay, now we're going to solder each wire onto the appropriate pin. Uh, I'll have a photo a little bit later which will show clearly which wire goes onto which pin. Uh, but essentially you're working with pins 2, 3 and 5. Uh, pin 2 is the shielded wire, pin 3 is the red wire, and pin 5 is the white wire. So we're all done there soldering. Uh, and here's a photo coming up. There we go. So we're not actually using uh, pin number one, and we're not using pin number four, and we're not using pin number six, seven, eight, and nine. We're only uh, looking at the, the top row of connectors there. Now what we're doing is we're putting on the stress relief of the cable. It's just got a couple of bolts that hold it down. Uh, this will stop the uh, wires from being pulled out if someone happens to yank on the cable once it's in the computer. And the other thing we will do is we'll spin, uh, we'll push that uh, insulation right over the pin so that it's nice and insulated there. And now we're just putting the plastic back shell in and uh, pushing all of those wires in. Top goes on. and we'll start putting in all of the nuts and bolts. Just have to tighten them up with a couple of bolts and uh, we should all be done. More, info uh, more information at apmp.com.au